Happy Independence Day weekend. It's a great time to test drive a new car. And this weekend, we're taking a look at an index that shows which cars are the most American, no matter where their parent company is located. In Made in America, Toby Keith sings about foreign cars. It breaks his heart seeing foreign cars Fill with fuel, it isn't ours And wearing cotton, we didn't grow But just what is an American car? The Dodge Hellcat's an outstanding car, but it's built in Canada and Dodge is owned by Italy's Fiat. Cars.com is out with their American-made index. They look at where a car is assembled, domestic parts content, where the engine and transmission come from, and how many U.S. workers are employed relative to vehicle sales. Number five on the list is the Chevy Volt, built in Detroit. Number four is the Ford Taurus, built right here in Chicago. Honda's Ridgeline pickup truck is number three, and the Honda Odyssey minivan comes in second. Both of them are built in Alabama. And the number one car made in America is the Jeep Cherokee, built right here in Belvedere, Illinois. It's a global economy, and I think we have to get used to that. This South Korean Hyundai Sonata is built in Alabama while Chevrolet builds their tracks in South Korea and in Mexico. And the Buick Envision SUV comes from China, just like your iPhone. To further confuse you, Toby Keith's guitar is not a U.S.-made Martin, Taylor, or Gibson. It's a Takamine, made in Japan. So I guess the message is it's probably best not to try to keep score. You can see the latest American-made index at cars.com. You can read Kelsey May's great column there. They compile the list every year.